It's Eileen from Elegant Marketplace, and I want to show you how to add a Google font, or more than one font, into your Divi-themed website. So first you're going to go to google.com slash fonts, and you're going to search through, and you're going to find a font that you want. So let's say we want Cabin. We click Add to the Collection. And you can add more than one, but I'm just going to add one. And then I'm going to click here for the review. So click here. And then you can see all the different options for your font. This is sort of similar, so it doesn't really give you the good like um, variety that some other fonts will. You can see here how it adds to your page load time, which may be a consideration if you wanted to choose something that looks kind of large, um, something that was a little faster. But for our purposes, we're just demonstrating, so it doesn't really matter. Then you're going to scroll down to the character sets that you want. And you're going to highlight this bit of code and copy it. And then you're going to go into your Divi theme website to integration. And right in here, this is a different one that I was practicing on earlier, but you're going to paste in that little bit of code. So like this is the one that I just copied. Then you're going to pop back over to your Google Fonts. And this is the font family information that you need. And you can copy that. And then you are going into General Settings and you're going to scroll down and you here is the H1 tag and then you just add in your font family. So you're going to have to put brackets on either side and then you're going to have to say if it's H1, H2, paragraph, etc. And then once you're done, you just click save and you are good to go. Um, if you have any questions, let us know.